Baruch Shani to Baruch 63. And the bright eighth waters which you have seen. This is the rectitude and uprightness of Yahiz Kiyahu, king of Yahuda, and the grace of Elohim which came upon him. For when Kenghech Seiv was stirred up in order that he might perish, and his wrath troubled him in order that he might thereby perish. For the multitude also of the nations which were with him. When, moreover, Yahiz Kiyahu, the king, heard those things which the king of Ashur was devising, that he was coming to seize him and destroy his people, the two and a half tribes which remained. Nay, more he wished to overthrow Sion also. Then Yahiz Kiyahu trusted in his works and had hope in his righteousness and spoke with El Elohim and said, Behold, for lo, Ken Kheriv is prepared to destroy us, and he will be boastful and uplifted when he has destroyed Sion. And El Elohim heard him, for Yahiz Kiyahu was wise, and he had respect unto his prayer, because he was righteous. And thereupon El Elohim commanded Ramiel, his angel, who speaks with you. And I went forth and destroyed their multitude, the number of whose chiefs only was a hundred and eighty-five thousand, and each of them had an equal number at his command. And at that time I burned their bodies within, but their raiment and arms I preserved outwardly, in order that the still more wonderful deeds of El Elohim might appear, and that thereby his name might be spoken of throughout the whole earth. And Sion was saved, and Yerushalayim delivered. Yasharael also was freed from tribulation, and all those who were in the Holy Land rejoiced, and the name of El Elohim was glorified, so that it was spoken of. These are the bright waters which you have seen.